What is up guys, it's Tom from Tech Time and I'm back with another video. Today I have a really cool product from a company, Daydream. This is their wireless headphones. So they're wireless earbuds, similar to what you see, you know, Apple has with their Apple AirPods, or Samsung has with their Icon X's, I believe is the name of them. So there's a lot of companies coming out with these, and these ones right here seem pretty cool. Uh, Deep Dream sent them out to me. Big shout out to them. If you have, you know, been part of the channel for a while, you know, I did a giveaway with a wireless charger. It was like a round circle puck style. It's actually one that I use in my house the most. They sent that out to me. It was a great wireless charger. Um, I hooked up a lucky subscriber with one in a giveaway and she's been enjoying it. So this is um, really nice of them to send these out and I can't wait to test them out and see how well they work. So let's get into the unboxing. Right here you got, you know, regular box, wireless headphones, slim cabinet for musical long playing. In the back, you have all the specs. You can pause that and take a look at that if you want. And let's get into the inside of the box. Got a little piece of paper there. And then right here, you have a golf ball. Now, this is the charging case that comes with it. You clip it in like this. This is off and on and it opens up and it reveals these beautiful little things right here. These are your earbuds. Wireless earbuds, fully wireless. So put those down for a second, we'll see what else is in the box. You have a charging cable, which is micro USB. You have earbud adapters for different size ears. So you have two different sets plus the set that's on there. So you get small, medium, large. And then deep down the bottom, you have a little carrying bag that you can use. That's pretty cool. And then you have your instruction manual. So most of this is in Chinese. Actually, all of it is in Chinese, I believe. <laughs> yeah, so I don't see any English. So we'll file that off to the side and I probably would not have read it anyways, so luckily for me. <laughs> let's get all this crap back in the box that I'm not gonna be using right now, and let's get into the bread and butter of these. This is, like I said, your charging case. So you can put this in, and it says you can charge them up to three times. You get two hours of music playback and three hours of phone call on these, so the battery life is definitely not gonna, you know, change the game on these, but two hours should be plenty while you're out and about, and then you can just slap them back in this little charging case. Very, very small, it, you know, it's bigger than a golf ball, but not much bigger, so you can really store this thing anywhere and have no issues with it. Let's see, where do you charge it? We'll check out that in a second. There you go, right there, so inside is your micro USB slot. Plug that in, and that's what will charge them up, charge up the case. These are magnetic, they say. All right, yep, sticks right in there magnetically, no problem. Perfect, so let's take one of these out. Look at that, really, really nice design. Looks similar to what you see with Samsung. There's your ear tip right there. Hi-fi stereo sound, they're saying, with these. These two, that's the two spots for the connector to charge it. There's the other one, same thing. So you can use this one ear if you wanted to, or you can use them in both, doesn't matter. And to me, this style is a lot better than what you're seeing with Apple and those AirPods. Um, ben on Lover of, Tech, uh, Lover of Tech said on his live stream the other day, it looked like two sticks coming out of his ears, <laughs> the Apple AirPods, and oh boy, that had me dying because that's exactly what they look like. It was a terrible, terrible design. And uh, these are much more refined looking and uh, I, I like these. I think these will definitely look more sleek in the ear and people won't be looking at you like you're crazy. So the power button's right there. You turn that on, I believe to charge it. I don't know if this has any juice, so let's see. I don't think there's any juice in the case. Let's see if there's any juice in these in general. So you pull this little tab off right here. 
and boom, there you go. So let's see how the hell we even get these turned on for starters. Let's check it out. Alrighty. We might have to pause this and see how we're gonna get these turned on because I'm not a huge user of these. This is my actually first wireless earbuds, completely wireless ones. So let me pause this, figure out how to turn this on and get this all set up and we'll get right back to you. Okay, so we're back. Uh, took a second, I actually used Bigsby Vision with Google Translate, translated the instructions just to double check and see what I was doing wrong or if I was doing anything wrong, um, but I wasn't. So I got it all figured out. I just didn't know exactly what was going on. So this is the charging case. When they're in here, they're charging. You take this out, both of them out at the same time, and you hold down. They have little touch sensitive panels on the side. You hold them both down, and then they both flash. Now you go over to your Bluetooth, hit your Bluetooth, and then it should start checking for them. And there it is, JH9105. I don't know if you guys can see that. Uh, right there, you hit OK. And they're connected that quick. So that was pretty quick. There's actually only one device connected for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, there they go. They're both connected. So connected for call and media. I thought only one was connected for call for some reason. So there you go. They're all set up. Now you can go to, I'll go to uh, Pandora and kick that on. The best way to get to your closest Pandora jewelry at 800 Boylston Street, Boston, Massachusetts. By hey, Google. Be a soldier. That's enough. Google always listening and thinking I know she knows what I want. I don't want that. <laughs> So let's see if we can get this, get you to hear this through the mic. I don't know, let's turn it up. The sound quality in these is really good. I don't know if this is gonna show up on the mic, but trust me, they sound really, really, really good. Um, very, very surprised for little wireless earbuds like this that they sound this good. Um, kind of blew me away. I just tried them on and I was like, wow, <laughs> these are definitely something that I could get used to using, especially at work. Uh, sometimes I run earbuds, you know, with the wire, especially the ones that come with my Samsung, the AKGs. <clears throat> I run those, the wire through my shirt and, you know, it just gets in the way. So at work, these would be perfect for me. You know, they go in your ear, if you don't know, they go in your ear like this and then this goes like up into your ear cavity and just kind of rests and it actually fits really tight. Um, the, like you said, you got the different ear bud connectors, the little tips, so you can put them on whatever one's going to fit your ear better. Um, you'll try it out, but I'll cut to a video right now of me putting them on and we'll check out how they go in, how they fit, stuff like that. All right, so let's get into how to put these in your ear and whatnot. So you get this little earbud right here. And you know, you might think, hey, put it in like this. And then you're looking just as silly as you were if you had a pair of Apple AirPods in your ear. But you're not gonna do that. You're gonna take it and it goes in like this. And then it tucks in your ear nicely right there. Hopefully you guys can see that. You take the second one, put that in, and there you go. You can jump, move around, they're sweat proof, so you're not gonna have any issues working out, running outside. You know, small amount of moisture from rain and stuff should not be a problem. You have touch panels on the side that are all touch sensitive, so that's your play pause feature, or if you wanna answer the call, because you can take phone calls with this. Um, I tested out a phone call not too long ago. The clarity was perfect. The person on the other end had no problem hearing me through the mic, so it worked out perfectly. You go like this to answer it, tap it once, tap it again to end the phone call. Perfect, easy, you know, no buttons or anything. Everything's just touch sensitive. Really, really innovative, and I, I like them a lot. For the price right now, they're $42.99, I believe, but they are doing a promotion for me and my viewers, so they are reducing the price to less than half. The promo code will be down in the description, so make sure you guys hit the Amazon link, go check them out, put in the promo code, and you'll get these right now for $21.50. 
while the promotion's going on. So make sure you scoop these up as quick as you can. Man, these are 100% go. Charging case, everything built in, so small. You can carry this thing with you anyway. You can put it in your pocket, you can, you can put it in a bag. If you're going out backpacking, you put it in your backpack. Like I said, a pocket, it's in your car, you can throw it in your cup holder. There's no issue. If you're on a bike, you can stash it. You can put this thing anywhere. Really, really, really small. You know what, super nice. You definitely don't wanna lose them, so you're gonna wanna put them right back in the case when you're done, but they go in two seconds, all done. You see how quick the pairing process was. If you need any answers or questions that you have, because most of the instructions are in Chinese or some type of uh, oriental language that I don't understand, I use Bigsby Vision. That's another reason why I like Bigsby. Uh, I was able to translate it through that, but you can use Google Translate, things like that, and shouldn't be an issue. But if you do have any questions, ask me, and if not, I can reach out to the company. But I definitely like these Deep Dream wireless earbuds. Go check them out. I'll leave the link down below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more stuff just like this, and I'll catch you later.